Hey guys, welcome back, and this is another command block tutorial. This one is on a uh, player mover. It's the fastest one around. So I've got two guys um, who've decided to help me. I've got um, George the Pigman and George the Pigman's brother. So how I'm going to um, conduct this test is by he's going to go by my card rail and he's gonna go by my mover and I've set the piston to push one tick later because it takes a while for the uh, minecart to start up so let's see who wins so as you can see the pusher is way faster than a minecart track and you can see it's the same distance with this line over here. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna just go um, in it myself. Um, you basically just need to sprint there. And as you can see, uh, just due to lag, it does that. So if I wasn't recording, um, that would work perfectly. Um, so a bit of lag stops it. I don't know if it works. I don't know if it's SMP friendly. I don't think it is. Um, but it works. It works perfectly when there's no lag. So um, yeah, <laughs> the lag kind of ruins it. So um, yeah, I'm gonna show you how to build a section of this. So um, it's basically repetitive. Um, placing blocks so I just use the same block with that so what you want to start off with is by getting your uh, blocks so you want a command block a repeater a pressure pads um, your block and a slab just so you can walk up onto the pushy pad um, and uh, sticky pistons. So I'm just going to build a tiny uh, section. So just to help you start up with your block placing, you just want to start off with a zigzag row, something like that. And then basically, what hap what's happening is the the pistons on this uh, side pushes you this way, and then I'll activate the piston here, and I'll push you this way, and I'll do it continuously. So this piston is going to push you this way and then the piston here is going to push you this way. So now it's easy to set up once you have those in place. You just have to go in a zigzag uh, format. Something like that. Don't need that one. Okay, don't need that one either. And now you just place your pistons. Okay. Once you've done that, you just want to place your blocks in, like that. Um, then you want to have repeaters coming out the back of each one. I also, I got this from Seth Bling's video of his instant thing, but I've just made it more compact with command blocks. Okay, so now that we have this. You just want to go and break all of your uh, pressure pads and just dig a too deep hole in the f uh, form of your uh, pressure pressure plates and we're going to use relative coordinates in these blocks so you just want to place down two and you just want to count two this way so one two That'll be two in the positive Z and two up. So we're gonna set block, um, set block, two up, two in the positive Z, and I wanna put a redstone underscore block there. And now this one we wanna place in that direction, so it will be two up and two across in the positive X. So set block, two two up uh, with a redstone underscore block ok 
Okay, so now that we have those, you just want to hold control and middle click and control and middle click. And then th these have to go all the way across to there, to your uh, to the end, and then these ones have to go across to there. So it will set block, or change all of these blocks to redstone blocks on and on the side. So now you can cover it up. So let's just quickly cover it up and then just put down these. Okay, so now that that's in place, it should sort of work, but it won't be usable again. So there we go. Okay, so you can kind of guess what I'm gonna do next. Okay, so let's just do that. Okay, the next step, um, is there a, no, there isn't, um, which one is it? Yeah, I think it's that one. Okay, there we go, so let's just make sure that works. Okay, there we go. Okay, so the next step would be the commands here. So, let's see, face the way of the pistons and you'll see negative Z or whatever it is. So negative Z, um, let's place this, and we're gonna set block, oh, why am I always in that, there we go, set block, um, what is it, negative Z, so 2, and it's gonna be quartz block 1, that is this block, so I just hold control, middle click, and then place all of them there. Now the next one will be the exact same, but a different way, so negative x, so let's take away that. Make it negative 2 on this side. Hold control, click, uh, middle click, and then just place them. Okay, so now it should be completed. Maybe you can add stuff like that and this. Okay. So there we go. As you can see, it's working. All commands will be in the description below. And I'll have them under titles. So the first one will be under the pressure plates. Second one will uh, be the resetting system. So it will do that. So there'll only be like four commands in the description. So uh, yeah. That is basically how this thing works. So thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Cheers. And I'll see you all in the next one.